What is up ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff Benjamin with iDownloadBlog and you can see my OS X dock here. It is a little messy. I have a lot of third-party apps in there. A lot of the apps that were originally there are no longer there. I've even turned the magnification on in the dock. It's resized as you can see here, etc. So what I'm gonna show you right now is how to reset the dock back to factory defaults. Make the dock look like it did when you first installed OS X. And that is the point of this video right now. So I'm gonna show you how to do this. All you need to do first of all is open up the terminal app. And the terminal app allows you to execute specific commands to reset the dock back to factory default. So the first command is this, defaults space delete space com dot apple dot Doc, and then hit the return key on your keyboard. It won't do anything once you do that. What you next need to do is to actually restart the dock and you do so using this command, kill all space dock. Now this will cause the dock to restart and then you'll see your changes take effect. So now let's go ahead and show you the full view of my monitor and you'll see the dock here. So there's the command ready to go. And of course my dock is below. Once I hit the return key, watch what happens. I'm gonna hit the return key right now. All right, so the dock restarts and bam, everything is back to factory settings. You can see the finder, the launch pad, Safari. So all the app icons in the dock are the same app icons that appear in the dock once you initially install OS X. And uh, any icons that were not there are removed. All the icons that were there originally are put back there and you can see even the magnifications turned off. Uh, the size of the dock is set back to defaults. So everything is just made to look like it was out of the box. And that's a really great thing if you wanna make your Mac look like new. So what do you guys think about resetting the dock or the ability to reset OS X back to factory settings? Do you think Apple should include the ability to reset back to factory settings easily like you can in iOS or do you think everything's fine as it is? Leave me a comment down in the comment section and like this video if you found it useful. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.